I would definitely come prepared for a, a few more things. After being there, I was like, I would never do this again. But after, upon leaving, I, I told myself, I was like, you know what, I, I would do it again. I'd love to do it again. Free food, place to stay, you know, I had to fool in there with the guys. I had a great time, you know, don't take it back for nothing. Absolutely. Connections and the, the PR that you get from it alone, I thought it was worth it. I'm already away from Australia, away from my family and friends, you know, living out in Albuquerque, and uh, I can't live in a fighter's house out there, so for me it wasn't too much different, and uh, you know, if I had the opportunity to do it again, I think I would. If I had to do it again, I would do it again, because all the benefits that come from doing it uh, far outweigh any of the um, small little negative things that, you know, you could you know, build up about the show. I enjoyed the majority of the time there. It was stressful because, you know, you don't have the phones and then the television, the radio, the, the leisures that you have at home makes you that much more grateful. But the payout of the show, the fans, um, you know, the support you get um, and, and the ability to, to step into mainstream, you know, MMA. I learned a lot about myself in, uh, in fighting as well. A lot of people have been trying their whole careers to get on the show. Fortunately for me, I got lucky and, uh, you know, it's definitely changed my career so far. Had it not been for the show, Dana, the Fatita Brothers, Spike TV, I wouldn't be in the position that I'm in right now.